special week on the Hill as Indian Hill hosted a national AASA learning conference. You can see educators that traveled from all over the country to meet our students and see how they learn. Welcome to the Hill. Good Friday to you. I'm Indian Hill CEO Superintendent Kirk Konecki and we were thrilled to partner with AASA, a national association for school superintendents and leaders, to put both our students and our world-class faculty and staff in the spotlight. Latif, everyone got a chance to really see what it means to be a Brave, didn't they? They sure did, Mr. Konecki, and we are so proud to see how our students demonstrated their leadership skills. We're excited to be here at Indian Hill Primary School to tell you a little bit about what it means to be a Brave. Tell me your name. My name's Ava. My name's Madhav. Madhav, what does it mean to be a Brave? To me, being a Brave means having each other's backs. Everybody works together, everybody makes new friends every year. We're not four schools, but one giant district. It was so great to talk to some of our primary school students today. Thank you both. Let's toss it to the elementary school. Hi, I'm Charlotte. Hi, I'm Hank. Hi, I'm Tamoki. This year, fifth grade went on a field trip to Green Acres to see how decomposers, consumers, and producers lived on a working farm. The most fun part was uh, finding some decomposer. Decomposer is examples of uh, like fungi, germs, small bugs in, in the soil. It was fun to get out of the classroom and learn things in real life and we learned so much. Let's send it to the middle school. Go Braves! Hi, I'm Jean from Indian Hill Middle School. Hi, I'm Tyler from Indian Hill Middle School. Hi, I'm Wally from Indian Hill Middle School. Hi, I'm Jackson from Indian Hill Middle School. These are students from the Unified Activities Club and they're here to tell you about their canned food drive. The canned food drive was a for me and it was for people that need food. It's really good for any help to help people. Seventh grade had the most with 660 canned foods. We are great students and we do need to help people. So great job to our seventh grade students and it's a great thing that they're helping Indian Hill. Now let's go to the high school. Hi, I'm Marin at Indian Hill High School and I'm with Lucas who is a part of the eSports team. Lucas, can you tell us a little bit about the eSports team? Yeah, so we compete uh, twice a year essentially, one uh, in the fall season and again in the spring season. We have a variety of a few different types of games, uh, Super Smash Brothers, Valorant, Fortnite, Overwatch. How long has the eSports team been a part of Indian Hill? So it was technically first founded in 2011 and we've had Valorant make it to states twice and Fortnite make it to state once. Lucas, what do you love most about eSports? Uh, something that makes it really great and different from many other sports is although it's competitive and you get to have many of the same things you get with another sport, it's also much more chill and you can hang out with your friends. Well, that's awesome. Thanks for joining me today. Back to you, Mr. Johnson. What an amazing week of happenings across all of our campuses. Mr. Konecki, back to you. Thank you, Latif. Braves, that is all for this week. Once again, welcome home. <laughs>